Thanks for taking the time to learn more about the Eye to Eye, Stealth's new head and neck positioning and support system. What we're going to be doing is uh, just giving you a little video of uh, one of our students using the Eye to Eye to assist them with their eating, and then we're going to have a short little video with um, showing how their um, eating and swallowing is without the, the Eye to Eye on a tr more traditional headrest. Underneath the bib is the chin prompt. So I'll raise that up lower. There you can see it, and that's helping Leslie keep her head upright and in midline. And she does really nicely with that. Good girl. Wow, that was a nice swallow. And we find that when the head is in a more midline position, it does help with, um, you know, with the swallow because the uh, the anatomical alignment is is a bit better. Um, also, um, for lip closure and being able to manage secretions, it's better when the head is upright. When the head is down, things tend to pull out, and it's harder to um, to get a swallow with in a head down position. In a, uh, with a more traditional headrest. And Maureen's gonna yeah. give a couple spoonfuls. You know, for safety, she does do better um, in the other uh, headrest, so we don't want to challenge her too much this way. But just so you can get an idea from the caregiver's point of view, um, you know, how she needs the one hand then to hold the head. And then you see that she fights that. Mm -hmm. Okay, buddy. All right. Okay, we need you to be safe so you can eat your lunch. And now she's, she's refusing to open up her mouth. Mm -hmm. Okay, are you ready? You tell me when you're ready. Just a couple of bites, Leslie, and then swap back. Yeah, let's just try. Let's just show Leslie how it's hard to eat lunch this way. Can you just try one time? And we get a lot more mm -hmm. of this. Yeah, a lot of, um, you know, you get a lot of reflexes, and as she tries to extend, it, it calls it, you know, her whole body has to react, and um, it's, you can see that, you know, everything in her body has to work instead of it just being more in a peaceful, restful position there. An increase in this, uh, you see this only. And she's so closing off her airway by having her, her head down. down. All right, buddy, let me help you. Come here, let's try this. Here we go. You're not really feeling safe to do it this way? Okay. Okay, we don't okay. have to do it. But okay, thank no you problem. for trying. Thank you. Thank you for trying. Let's, Let's put you on the collar. On. Let's swap that. Readily, she's willing to, mm -hmm. to eat this two seconds later. Yep. Yeah. I think without this, she feels less stability and mm -hmm. it just interferes right. with the whole entire body. You can just see that her whole body is at rest now. You know, she's not having to. Uh, use all her strength to try and hold her head up. Good job. And as um, Maureen mentioned before, it is an, an endurance thing too. If you don't have to expend all your energy trying to hold your head up, then you have it available for other things. Let's call her um, on. Reach out and touch switches, reach out and help turn pages, reach out for objects and pictures and all those, th those sort of activities. Without that, she is just fighting and holding on mm -hmm. um, and it's uh, able to, less able to do a whole lot mm -hmm. of things with her. about the headrest on and I'm standing in front of her. Les, can you lift your head to say hi to me? <coughs> That's it. Did you enjoy your lunch today? Maureen feeding you? You looking over at Big Bird over there? What's on the wall? Looking around? Can you come find Elmo over here? And here's his balloons uh, all the way up. Very good. So we want to point out the difference between the two that when um, 
you know, Leslie's head is upright, she can make eye contact with me and is uh, for socialization, for learning, for teaching, whatever. That's so much better than when you saw before when she was looking at the floor, someone's feet, her tray, you know, sideways. And so you can see there's a big improvement and a much greater opportunity for Leslie to learn when her head is in an upright eye-to-eye -eye position.